winner. What you doing out of day? Slick talker since a jet. Winter time, all the time, ooh. Yeah. Look at the way that I move. Swag. Disrespectful and I'm rude. Okay. I had cocaine in the school. Uh, Hey, this is Kamal. Welcome back to a new video of One Piece Round Two. All right, so this is Zevel Hundred Six Star here to the Shogun of Wano Kozuki Odin, or you can say V Two Odin gameplay. Though, honestly, this Odin is very, very broken. Thanks to OP Reaper for giving us the account to use this Odin. Though, honestly, I must say that like, when he is inside the flag, he is broken or. Unkillable though. You know there was a revolutionary army character, or you can say revolutionary army waifu. When she uses that skill trait area, she can't die, and one HP will be left for that character whenever she is using that skill, or whenever she is inside that trait area, or whosoever is inside that trait area. Same for this character also, but he don't need any skills for that though. You just have to be inside the flag or treasure area, and one HP will be left for full match till you are inside the flag area. So that thing is very, very broken. So status effect or any skill or anything you enemies use, you guys are not gonna die. So not only in your own treasure area, whether it's your own treasure area, whether it's your enemy's treasure area, or whether it's a neutral treasure area. That means like whether that flag is not taken by enemy or by your team, still one HP will be left till you guys are inside the treasure area. Though, so that thing is really, really broken as fuck. Really, really goaded as fuck. Damage, offensive, defensive. That I'm not gonna talk about that much, but that thing is crazy. So when you are inside the flag area, you guys are gonna survive the whole match. Though, I would say like I have to see the middle set. Though there should be a middle set in which he is not gonna get that much knockback, or whether he is not gonna get out of the treasure area. Though that would be the best middle set. I have to see that middle set. Though that would be a coded ass middle set for this Odin. Though all right, let's go to first match in SS League using this Kozuki Odin. Thanks to OP Reaper. Make sure to check out his channel. Link in description, and he gets like all the X characters or bound first characters level hundred. Though. And he has X white beard level hundred also on this account only. So let's go to first match in SS League using this unit. All right, first match. There is white beard. There is Kaden Law. There is another Kaden Law. And Hakuba Cavendish black beard, bro. Band I didn't release the new black beard, so people be using this black beard only. Okay, okay. All right, we are ready to go, bro. Move, morphos. Okay. Wow, there is a this law. Someone is using this law. That's crazy. Make sure you guys are fighting inside the treasure area. So no matter whose treasure area that is, make sure you are you inside the treasure area. And this this skill that I just used, make sure to use it properly, cause when you are using that skill, it has a long range skill, and that can make you or take you away from the treasure area. So, so if you use that skill inside treasure area, you guys will get outside the treasure area. So make sure to about that though. And no matter you guys are getting status effect or anything, you guys will still not die. Make sure that you are not out of the flag when you are getting hit by the status effect. If you are like affected by the status effect and you get it outside the treasure area, then it's gonna damage you. So remember that and be careful about that. Though. You guys can see I have one HP only, and enemies are literally going crazy on my. I'm just like trying to survive inside the flag. One HP whole match, bro. That's crazy. That's literally crazy, bro. He's actually really, really broken on that thing. Take flag, take flag. I'ma eat that meat. Okay, nice. Eat it that meat, though. Okay, crazy. I'm gonna take that flag also, cause 
it doesn't matter whether I'm on my own flag or on the enemy flag till I am inside the flag area though. There are some characters like Blackbeard or Luffy or some characters who can remove me from the flag area. They are the only problem other than that. It's fine I guess. Everything is fine. Okay, nice dodge we did. Okay, someone tried to take the flag. Okay, you guys can see I have 1 HP again. And both skills give me heals though, so that's also a crazy shit. Look at that, I got some heals by using these skills. Perfect dodge. Okay, chill. Get me out of here. I'm gonna get out of here. Okay, perfect dodge again. Grab. Okay, Zoro came out of nowhere. Last 20 seconds left and we survived the whole match though. Being inside the enemy's flag area also. Okay, use this skill. I'm gonna stop enemy from taking the flag for some time at least. Okay, one second left and okay, that was close. That was close. 6 K score. I would say like really nice match for MVP also. And damage and tankiness. The main thing is surviving. He, this guy survives the whole match. One capture, four kills. Really nice match. Let's go some more matches in SS League though. Okay, this is the second match. I started it a little bit late because I forgot to start the recording though. All right, you guys can see I was like taking damage for no reason because I was inside the flag. So I was like, okay, we're going to survive by that though. If I get out of the flag, I'm going to die. I know that reason because I get affected by this shit a lot. But if I get a KO or I damage, I get heals also though. So I get some crazy heals. So that's how I survived or I would have been like dead though being a 1 HP and get it in getting infected by the status effect. That's crazy. Chill. I'ma take this flag. Okay, almost got the flag. Someone played the flag though. Use your main skill, Luffy. Okay, I tried to dodge but dodge didn't happen. Okay, there is a enemy behind me also, but I want to be like in Okay This I don't know like who the fuck is this guy bro, but nah This guy literally messed up my so many matches though cause the Odin is was getting affected by only this character though cause when I'm like clapping cheeks of enemies being inside the flag He just uses his skill and Oh, Shanks did a counter and okay, messed up at that time only. W. I was saying, like, whenever I was like inside the flag, this Mofa removes me from the flag area and like uses a skill that was like really crazy. Okay, grab that. Rage you easy. He removes me from the flag area and then like gives me more and more damage. So that was like really annoying as fuck though. And okay, that guy is still using. Look at that. That was the skill I hate. Mm, right now, I'm like hating this character like a lot. Though this Luffy, while using Odin. Okay, I wanted to kill him so bad, but Cracker killed him. But okay, it is what it is. At least we won though. Five point eight six score. Really nice match. Not score, not MVP. This character is a surviving character that can survive the whole match with nice damage and defense also. Two capture, two gears, 5.8k score. Let's go third match in SS League. This is the guy that was annoying me a lot though. Okay, third match. There is Whitebeard, there is G5 Luffy, King, Uta, Nami. Okay, characters like that. I think like, I don't know like if Blackbeard will come or Roger will come. If Blackbeard comes, I'm pretty much sure that Blackbird will have a normal skill like that that can remove Odin from the flag area though. And that is going to be like really annoying as fuck cause Odin is god, literally god inside the flag area. But outside, nah. Outside is not that good though but inside is broken. Literally broken as fuck. This character is broken as fuck inside the flag. If he's inside, he's broken. If he's outside, not so broken. 
Let him stay inside, guys. Let him stay inside. Okay. Mofo is gonna get the flag. Both use his skill. Alright. Both of the Odin got hit. Okay, both trying to take the flag. And both died also. He said not bad at all. Alright, let's go again. Both were doing the same mistake. Imagine. And both used the Odin on the wow. That's crazy. Okay, that card already died. Before anything happens. Okay, wow. Bro, the, is there any skill that is like more stronger than King's skill though? Oh wow, I died again, nice. Cause no matter what I use. I'd be like king literally king skill always works though look at the glitches bro and then bandai says that glitches are fixed seriously look at the glitches okay g5 Luffy grab I literally I was literally down on this one for use his skill and I'm dead okay let me get the flag she's scared Uta scared trying to find his daddy Scared of Odin. Okay, X Luffy came. Okay, Mofo also dodged but still died. Look at that Uta, bro. She thought that she can survive. Look at that. And now I'm unstoppable, bro. I'm unstoppable. Unstoppable. Literally unstoppable. Take the flag, G5 Luffy. Okay, I'm gonna focus I got the flag W. W. Okay. Nice. Mofo gonna use his main skill. Yep. Ah, what skill he used? Being inside the flag, I'm safe. I'm safe right now and we won this one also nice match nice 5.2 gift score on surviving he is top top notch 2 capture 4 kills really nice Odin is really good as fuck broken literally broken and the best part about this corrector is you guys can get this corrector in 750 RDS only I mean in cheap amount of RDS you guys can get this Odin and then you guys can like be really really annoying as fuck when you are inside the flag. I mean like no matter which character is there, no matter how broken or good ass character is there. If you are inside the flag, no one can kill you. So that's like really good as fuck. I would say that this is a like really good it has beat banner before the next EX though. Now we don't know. You guys can use this skill also to move faster or forward. If you want to take that. I mean like old players or old characters we used to do that. Oh you guys can do that with Odin also. Yeah, so I must say like this character is like really good it has beat before the next EX though. We don't know if next EX is going to be Blackbeard or Roger or characters like that. Because people are talking about these two characters only most of the times. So let's see which of the character will come. If it's going to be Blackbeard or it's going to be Roger. But you guys think you guys can tell us on comment section though. Okay, Cracker gonna eat that meat I guess. Alright, I will be having 1 HP. I know that. Yep, I knew it. It's gonna be like that now. Oh, come on, no. Not status effect outside the flag. Okay, let's go, let's go. Oh, come on. Easy. Ah, uh, nice. This king is also actually really annoying though. Damage is a lot. And once he gets perfect dodges, that's like really annoying. 
Okay, get out of the flag, big mom. She dodged. Grab with that Zora. Okay, easy. Look at that. When I'm inside the flag, no one can stop me. Literally no one can stop me, bro. Oh, come on. Where this king came from? That king came from nowhere, though. Our uh, last 20 seconds left. We have to use this collector. I'm gonna stop enemies from taking flag. Take the mid flag. Take one more flag, guys. Come on. Oh, no. It's full as fuck and last 10 seconds left. No way. Okay, stop them. Grab their cheeks. Nope. Big Mom can't take the flag. I mean, we tried. We tried, but I lost. It is what it is. 4.9k score, almost 5k score, 2 capture, 6 kills. Really nice match after losing also. Alright, last match is in Dress Roller Stage. So I'm using Sanji now with G5 Luffy obviously. 2 G5 Luffy, Kaido, X White Bear, Green Shanks and Uta. I see how it is. Vestra also. Nah damn. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Let's go team. Take the flag. Okay. Till I'm inside the flag, no one can kill me. But once I get outside the flag, these no force can attack or kill me. Okay, take flag, take flag. I'm here only. Don't get that flag. This wide bear knows that I don't have a skill. Okay, this skill, this skill just I uh, used that can't go through was so okay wow fishy also don't hit on that invincible skill i see okay now i'm inside the flag i can survive oh come on that was like fishy came too soon didn't she just came Okay, thanks for the meat. I'm dead. Yep, I know I'm dead. Okay, let's go. Easy grab. Ah, uh, messed up. This don't go through gaps. River gaps. Okay, let me take that flag. Let's focus on winning instead of killing more. Take flag. Okay, fishy game. Kill and lot, take flag, take flag. Okay. Oh, uh, he also dodged. Didn't saw that. Someone stop them. Bro. I can't remove G5 Luffy when he's taking the flag. Damn, that's crazy. Someone get the flag, bro. We need Big Mom right now, sir. We lost this one also. Crazy. Lost this one too. Damn.
really them. 4.3 k score to capture 3 kills. I guess we played fine though. Using Odin. I would say Odin is really really broken. More. I would say like more than damage or more than offensive or tankiness. I love that this character can survive the whole match being inside the flag. Doesn't matter if it's your own flag, enemy's flag or it's a neutral flag. You guys can survive on that flag area for full match though. So just make sure that you are inside the flag and you're good. It would have been like really better if he was a defender, but we already have a defender character like that from Revolutionary Army. Maybe that's why he's an attacker, but attacker, you guys know that he gets knocked back or removed from the flag really easily though. That is the only problem. If you guys have any meta set that is going to stop him from getting away from the flag area or removing him from the treasure area, do let me know in the comment section. And do let me know if you guys summoned on this Odin or not and how many gems you guys use and did you guys got him or not. And that's it for the video and thanks for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe for more video content. Hence the next gameplay videos like that. And do let me know how many gems you guys have, still have for next EX and who is going to be the next EX, Roger or Blackbeard. And whether you guys already summoned for Whitebeard and Odin both of them and you guys already have both of them. Do let me know. And I'm gonna see you guys on the next one. Till then, bye guys, bye bye. When it's time, all the time, ooh, yeah Look at the way that I move, swag Disrespectful and I'm rude, okay I had cocaine in the school, uh, When I went hell of a 